welcome to a new HiCard short clip. In this video I would like to introduce you to some new features in modeling. Let's start with the cam joint which can now be started via the first plane in the context menu. Graphic symbols in the dialog provide a better understanding of the options. When processing cams the bores can now be inserted offset. Several manufacturer catalogs are also available in the catalog under user-defined flow drilling. During NCX export these are exported as type flow drilling. A highlight in Service Pack 1 is the new move and rotate via planes function which replaces move and rotate via points. Here you first select a start plane and then a target plane. A preview shows you the possible results. By cleverly setting the planes you can save yourself a lot of clicks. The mitre cut beams function has been changed to a connected feature. This means that the mitre in the second beam is also recalculated and deleted. This has also optimized the calculation sequence when updating the assembly. With the update it is possible to exchange several standard part groups that were not inserted via bolting or the configurators. This means that the same standard part types, for example screws, can be exchanged together. There has been a small improvement in the search for functions in formulas. The functions have been consolidated so that now only occur once and are better grouped by name. In addition, further functions such as Roundup are now also offered. When using the Cleanup Intersection function you can use the new option to drill off the resulting inside corners, similar to how it works in CAM processing. The revised lettering is correctly placed onto cylinder surfaces with Service Pack 1. This means it can also be positioned well on pipes. HiCut now also calculates the surface from the development contour and the rectangular surface of the development for steel plates if the two options are activated in the configuration. Last but not least a highlight in the sheet metal module, the pipes and vessels function has been revised. The standard types are available for selection in the new dialog. The part can be created as solid or directly as a sheet metal part. You also have all the important parameters of the part at a glance. The fitting point can be selected with a right click. The two endpoints are displayed graphically. If the part is a sheet metal part, the sheet parameters are available as in the connection sheet. That's all for this high cut short clip. I hope you enjoyed it and wish you lots of fun designing.